your awakening message begins now. So open your soul. Maybe Thez is for you. November is here and with it merge with our twin flames. Each month, there are specific lessons we area unit meant to be guided through, and with the ever-changing seasons, November has traditionally been a month for diving deep. This is the month once we are called to target our soul's work. November is represented by the amount 11, that is one in every of two master numbers in study. The number 11 represents synchronism, the diving calling and also the prospect of recent beginnings on the horizon. In fact once we see this number, 11, 11, out within the world on clocks, phone numbers or perhaps license plates, it s the universe giving us a sign to focus, to seem at what s trying to decision to us. It s also lets us know that we re on the correct track. This month is no exception. It s a year wherever we ve all been asked to dig deep, to find the reality, to find the reality. The end of a year is often a time for reflection, and with the modification of seasons, it s also a decision to go inside and spend time that specialize in what we want and who we are. Naturally, there is a season for everything there could be a season to plant, to grow, to harvest and to rest. At the top of the harvest season, we are currently reaching to the basis of what has been growing for a few time, and now as once we are speculated to be endowed the bounty of what we've reaped. For many of us, it appears that the thought of merging with our twin flames has become a serious focus and whereas maybe it has not the label that is most important, it appears that it also helps in distinctive different connections from each other. The reason that so many have had interactions with the person they believe to be their twin flame is that we created a soul contract with them before returning into this lifetime. We knew that so as to do our deepest work, we might also got to do it along, as a result of none of us are alone in our destiny. One of the foremost interesting aspects of a deep soul contract is however each person will affect the other depending upon what stage of awakening or ascension they re in. If one or each individuals are still troubled and vibratory at a lower frequency, then they re going to really repel the one with whom they need the connection with. Because whether we decision them are twin flames, we want to really be within the place to join them during this life till we are prepared for them, which means that we will take possession of our wounds and not project them. It also implies that we've e done and are still current of doing our own work, because the purpose of this connection is not to solely join once the work is done, however to enhance that method for every person involved. There is no final destination for these varieties of connections though, it solely depends upon wherever each person is on their own path and what lifetime they are in. That being said, one thing special will occur during November each year that has meant to bring these varieties of connections into our lives. In moments of reflection, we could notice that we met a person of importance during this month, or that we v had some major milestones with them during this season. However every time that our ways crossed OS and T continuously mean that they are meant to join it solely means that the souls are checking in on one another to check however they redeveloping subconsciously, and to see if they re probably ready to join and achieve some deeper soul work. This is the dance of the twin flames. They come in and out of our lives, typically for long periods of your time, and sometimes shorter. Yet, it s not the period that matters most, however the intensity. The beautiful issue about these deep, inexplicable connections is that time is impertinent, and there is no such issue as too late or missed opportunities. In fact, it is this dance we de like so as to continually grow into our greater purpose, with the irony being that only this type of connection will foster that growth. Think of it like gardening in our own yards, once we plant the seeds, we don't he come subsequent day to reap the fruit. However, we do check in on them to check however they re doing to see if watering or fertilizing is required. Then time passes, and maybe we don't check in as often, 
However suddenly we see fruit commencing to grow upon the plant has delicate vines. But still, we don't choose the fruit, as a result of it s not however ripe. Only when the fruit is ripe and prepared to be picked can we finally enjoy what we've been tending. Our deepest soul connections are no totally different than the fruit we've eat taken time to grow. Typically it has simply a register, typically it has a push for growth, and at others times, it has going to finally be ripe enough to enjoy. It has an expertise that may be different for every one of us, because we are all at totally different stages of personal growth, and similar to once we are growing our own fruit and vegetables. There is no got to rush the process. There is no got to force these connections in any means, because they truly grow best once left to do it organically and naturally. Because things will only happen in their own time, and similar to in nature the better of things always take time. Share our messages, dude. I will provide, a daily angelic, guidance number love, and angelic blessing, send of the message, watch your channel, awakening people, previous videos for a universal understanding, subscribers will be, updated with the latest articles, and, informations. Leave your suggestions, in the field below. All the love to you. Beautiful souls. And, we are proud of you as viewers, and of your support for your channel, all, for awakening people. And please support us, to develop, our work, develop, our work.